What vision do you have for your lawn care company? Hey guys, welcome back to Lawn Crack. And today I am stealing a page out of Tim Burgess and Maximizing Results book because I am gonna ask you, what do you see? Like what vision, what, what do you see your company looking like in the, in the near future, in, in one year, in three years, stuff like this. Uh, what, what I learned from going through Tim's material is <clears throat> that we think in pictures. So the way he explains it is, I'm gonna use his, his same method of explaining it. He says, okay, picture your refrigerator, right? So you get a mental image of your, your refrigerator, you can open the doors, you know if it's a freezer on top or if it's split down the, the side and where everything is in your fridge, you can see it, you can see it. I say, picture my refrigerator and you're like, I don't know, you don't know what color it is, you don't know what kind it is, you don't know what's in it, you know nothing about it. So with your refrigerator, you have clarity. With my refrigerator, you have confusion. So if you don't have a clear mental picture in your mind of what you're trying to do with your business, then you have confusion. So that's why we talk about, on the podcast, we talk about goals all the time and, and you know, reading material to get, gain a better understanding and stuff like this but it is just it's just so important if you're trying to build a business to a, a certain point like you got to know what that certain point is like if you're making say you're making uh, you're just getting started and you made you know twenty five thousand dollars last year um, you put twenty five thousand dollars in your pocket owning your lawn care and landscaping company right and you want to put a hundred thousand dollars in your pocket sometime in the future by running your lawn care and landscaping company what has to happen for to be able to, to produce that revenue this is this not magically going to happen you're not going to just continue uh cutting the same handful of lawns and doing the same couple little jobs you're doing and magically make a hundred grand you're going to have to add trucks you're gonna have to add equipment you're gonna have to get a space to keep all your stuff you know you're gonna need routing uh, scheduling invoicing soft software you're gonna need an accountant you probably want to have a lawyer you know ready to go if need be uh, so what what does it look like you know how, how many trucks so okay if I want to make a hundred grand I need at least four trucks out every day so we got four trucks so we're gonna have to have trailers with some of those trucks we're gonna have to have mowers we're gonna have to have uh, maybe you need a bobcat maybe you need whatever it is you need spray tanks you need employees all that kind of stuff you need to plan this out get a real clear vision in your head of what what you want your lawn care company to be and then use a tool like the profit calculator to figure out how do the numbers work out to get there? Like, how many lawns are we gonna have to service to cut three hundred thousand dollars worth of grass this year? You know, it's. Uh, I remember when my dad used to uh, tell me to do these projected numbers and all this stuff all the time, and I'm like, no, but dad, you don't understand because like some some customers, you know, they get cut every week, and some get cut every other week, and you know. So, every year it gets cut a different number of times and everybody's mowing price is a little different and and he was right on this you just take the averages what what's the average what's your average cut price on average how many times do you cut the lawns and yeah and that's gonna tell you how much money you're gonna make um, you know multiply it by how many customers you have and bam that's uh, that's how much money you can expect to make from mowing that, that's one of the reasons why I like mowing so much. It's so simple. But, you know, we got, we got the whole winter coming up here. This is a great time to really do some planning on your business, fine tune what you got going on, think about what else you need, um, you know, do some research into, into different software programs. If you haven't got a software program, I recommend Service Autopilot. I know it's a, a little expensive if you're just getting started but 
I think for what it does, it saves you so much time. Once you get going in this industry, you're gonna realize how valuable your time is. So a program like Service Autopilot will make a huge difference. Um, you know, look at, look at your trucks, your equipment. Is uh, something getting ready to fail? You might wanna sell that for as much as you possibly can and get a new one with a low monthly payment, stuff like that. So just get a clear image of what you're trying to do with your business and then work towards that goal every single day. And before you know it, you will get there and you'll get to set a new goal and um, you know continue on your path to success. But it's Ryan with Long Crack. Hope everyone is doing well. Thank you so much for watching the video and catch us on another one. Keep making money.